and then you start wrapping upwards. So that's what I start doing. You wrap down her about three times, three times, and then you start going up. That's how you just secure the ends. You can always palm roll the ends. It's really up to you. Like you do this to your comfortability or however. I don't know what people say. Now boom, you have this ugly looking lock. And it's like flimsy. I know it's ugly, right? Yeah. Alright. Take this other piece of hair. This piece of hair isn't as thick as the first piece of hair you had, but it's still thick enough. Is this the right color? Okay, it is. Now this is this is where it kind of gets tricky. You want to take this and bend it up like this. Okay. Now bend it up like that and go right here. Then you grab both the pieces, grab this real tight right here, grab it real tight, and you wrap upwards again, but wrap in the opposite direction that you were wrapping. So if I, if I was wrapping right over left, I'm going to wrap left over right. So, am I? Yeah, that's how you wrap. Yeah. Or it's probably still right over left, but going upwards. I don't know, but you know what I mean. So what I did was I went, I twisted up, and then when I got to the bulky part, I got, I started back twisting down the, the piece of hair ooh, that I had. So it won't be that flimsy, but it still be flimsy, but I don't mind. As long as it looks somewhat thick, I don't mind. So that's all you do. And then you just twist the remaining of that, and then you're good. See? Fine. It is going to be a little flimsy, but who don't want flimsy looks like? Come on now. As long as they look distressed, I'm not worried. Okay, okay, so this is how they're looking so far. They look real cute. Oh, yeah, let's get back to the time lapse because I just I already made a video explaining, but I didn't like how that video came out, so I'm gonna probably delete that after I'm done with my hair. And yeah, y'all gonna see this part. Like, you don't know my work, niggas capping like this, bruh.